He's mine. Let him go. Let him go, and we'll leave. you just fine, huh? Let's see it again. Light up that haystack right there. Come on, man. Don't be shy now. You got this. Ooh. Oh my god, did you see that? Yes, I saw that. <laughs> All right, don't stop now. Please be careful. What? My bag. What? My bag with all my money. I left it in the bar. Well, how much are we talking? 60, 70. What, thousand? Yeah! Thousand? 60 grand and a space gun? Who the hell are you people? Get in the truck, let's go. Come on! Are you guys serious? I got in your truck because you guys seem like some good guys, you know? Plus, if you did try anything funny, I'm pretty sure even I could take you in a fist fight, so. <laughs> to fist fights. Mm -hmm. That um thing your brother has in there. You need to call someone about that. Can't do that. Right. Well, whatever it is you've gotten him into, he's going to figure it out eventually. I hope you're ready for that. My name is Joseph Fraioli, and I'm the sound designer for the movie Kin. It was really early on that the directors Jonathan and Josh Baker had the idea that all of the technology in the film would have a magnetic energy behind it. So I spent a lot of time generating and recording sounds that would resemble magnetism conceptually. Whether the sound was organic or synthetic or a combination of the two, the goal was to create a world of sound based around magnetism that was hopefully unique to the audience. For the cleaner's vocalizations, I came up with a process where I would record long passages of dialogue of both my wife and I talking, and then scramble and process the dialogue, which enabled me to go in later and edit together the individual phonemes to create a new language for these characters to communicate with. After spending a lot of time with the film, I had come to this idea that there was artificial intelligence within the technology that can differentiate between who's using it and almost take on their personality. Someone who shouldn't be using it, someone who should be using it, it'll behave and sound differently based on what actions they're doing as well. And that aspect of the storytelling is all told through sound.
if I'm hard on you, it's because the world is hard. You've seen that. And I just need you to stay out of trouble, okay? Oh my god. brother just got out of prison. I know I've been away for a long time, but I want to make sure that you know that you're important to me. I want you to be careful around him. Welcome home, my man. I know I owe you guys some money. I just want you to know I'm not dodging you. Oh. Let him go. The hell is that thing? I found it. Somebody's got to be looking for this thing. That thing your brother has in there? You need to call someone. Turn to bed. Find him. He's here somewhere. Dangerous people are coming after us. I know I'm not a good guy, but it's been pretty incredible to be brothers for the first time. Whatever you've gotten him into. He's gonna figure it out eventually. I hope you're ready for that. They're coming, man! Go! I can't believe this whole time you haven't told me this! Go, go! Get away from my brother. Maybe keep that thing on the first mode, yeah?